ahead of the president to not have him run for a second term. Tom Fitton joins us this morning. Is the president losing the Democrats? Good morning. Well, he's losing senators. You know why? Because they're all nervous. Are they going to be subject to the same type of scrutiny? I think the big criminal issue for Joe Biden isn't necessarily records he had from his vice presidency, uh, because uh, the law, I think, allowed him to take records as he so chose or just take records generally. Uh, it's these Senate records that are classified that are in his possession or were in his possession. You know, there's no out. There's no presidential out. There's no vice presidential out from being held accountable for that, at least. And the question is, are they going to go up to Delaware, the University of Delaware, where Judicial Watch has been fighting for documents for almost two years now to gain access to his Senate records? 1,800 boxes of records are up there, Stuart. We don't know what's in them. And now we can presume classified materials up there as well. Well, we have these congressional investigations that are about to start. In fact, some of them have already started. How far can they go? It occurs to me that the White House can always turn around and say, wait a minute, we've got a special counsel handling this. We're going to delay on your investigations. Just a delay tactic. Is that possible? Well, there are two issues of uh, investigation here, at least. One is the FBI and the Justice Department's special treatment of Joe Biden. Hmm. No raid, no subpoenas. You know, let's cover it up for two months while we're abusing Trump. And the second issue is, is, is President Biden's uh, personal accountability here. And there's nothing to prevent uh, the House of Representatives uh, from asking the president to testify on these issues. You think that's likely? No, but, um, you know, if they're thinking impeachment or something of that nature, uh, it's, it's a, certainly a possibility. And... You know, Joe Biden has is, is put it all out on the table. He says there's no there there, and we should all be confident that his documents are secure with his Corvette. You know, certainly that doesn't help his argument that he shouldn't be held accountable. I just get the impression these investigations are going to drag on for months, if not years. Tom Fitton, thanks very much for joining us, Tom. We'll be back to see you again soon. You're welcome. Thank you. Now,